Well, it is time for our Daily Talker. Or should we say the Daily Talker? We're talking about wicked good accents, Boston accents. That's right. Growing up here in Mass, <laughs> I've been hearing it forever. My parents have it. <laughs> now it turns out the way we talk is hot in Hollywood. Roby's here with more. Chris, oh my God, you sound like you grew up in Dorchester instead of wicked fancy Melrose. <laughs> <laughs> fancy <laughs> Mr. Melrose. Silver Spoon over there. <laughs> <laughs> hey, shout out to my peeps in Worcester, Fall River, Gloucester, Revere. How you doing? Last night on CBS News, they did a wicked good piece on Boston accents. They interviewed a casting agent who finds actors to talk like I am right now. How painful is that? Her name's Angela Perry from Boston Casting. One day, like 400 freaking people showed up to audition at a warehouse or whatever. They're not going to be stars or nothing, just bit players. Hey, you're not going to be the next Marlene Streep or Lawrence Oliver, so relax. Anyways, Angela tested him out asking him to say stuff, not lame stuff like Harvard Yard or whatever. Now shut up you, and open up your ears and just listen, will you? My name's Natalie Foley. I'm from High Park. I'm a You're done. <laughs> Welcome to Fenway Park, the greatest ballpark ever. Ever! 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 ever. Okay, that kid wasn't bad. All right, so we asked, is this whole accent thing good? Is it bad for your career? What do you think about it? Caitlin says on Twitter, best daily talker ever. I approve from Worcester. Caitlin, I love you. Let's grab some beers. Tony on Facebook says, sometimes it's like you're speaking a different language. When I was on vacation, no one knew what a Kmart was. <laughs> she probably never heard of Zaya or Jordan Marsh. Neither. Okay, here's how you comment. You jump on your computer, unless you're a knucklehead. You go to the website, you type something down there, you go on Twitter, you go on Facebook. Have at it, all right? See ya. Oh, my gosh. Roby, well done. And we, we think that he should have tried out for the audition because he clearly he, has what it he's takes. He's got what it takes. Wicked. Awesome. All right. All right.